you just leave me alone? I'm sorry, I'm not perfect like you. I'm not perfect. I just try to live my life according to the word of God. Oh my gosh, don't bring your stupid religious crap into this. Yeah, I believe in the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. I'm going to bow down to them every day and every night. Hallelujah, praise Jesus. Don't, all right, just don't. I don't understand you. Open your eyes, look around you. God created you and me. God the Father gave his son Jesus to die for our sins. All you need to do is ask forgiveness and you will be with him forever in eternity. And if you don't, you're gonna spend eternity in the lake of fire. <laughs> that is so stupid. I mean, listen to yourself. How can you even believe in the accuracy of a religion that was started like thousands of years ago by a bunch of old guys that wrote a bunch of books? I mean, how can you even believe that that crap could be accurate? That's I, so stupid. But I do believe. The Bible's one of the most historically accurate books ever written. Books and the writings of those like Plato and Aristotle were written hundreds of years after the fact, when the Bible was written at most only 30 years after the fact and it was inspired by God. In fact, all the books of the Bible are inspired by God. Moses was led to write about creation through God. It was all through the inspiration of God. Yeah, whatever. Look, there's no contradictions, there's no inaccuracies. Even the writings, secular writings of history, confirm the events of the Bible. They confirm the accuracy of the Bible. I mean, the proof is out there, and all you need to do is ask forgiveness and accept Jesus into your heart. I can't buy that, okay? Just... You know, I really hope that you give your heart to God. It's the best thing that you ever do. I mean, I care about you. You know that. I want you to end up in heaven. Here, look, you can have my Bible. It's down here somewhere. No, no, really. That's okay. It, no, it's it's down here. It's... Too much stuff in here. Welcome, my children. Behold the Son of God, seated at the right hand of the throne of God. I am. You have all reached the gates of the kingdom of heaven. No one may come into the kingdom but through me. If you have loved me and accepted me, your name shall be found in the book of life. If your name is not listed, you shall be cast in the lake of fire and suffer the eternal torture of hell. Jesus, Lord, Savior, is my name in the book of life? My child, you are most certainly welcome. Are you scared? I prayed. I asked Jesus into my heart. Lord, I know I wasn't much of a Christian, but... You may rise, my child, for you are worthy of entering. Since you have prayed and asked, your sins have been forgiven. Welcome to the kingdom of heaven. Come here, my child. Why is it that you fear me? My name's not in that book, is it? You have denied me by the word of your mouth and by your heart. Your sin is not acceptable in the kingdom of my Father. I will hear you no more, just as you did not hear me.